One of the best ways to grow our business is by having positive testimonials and feedback and reviews. Now, some of you may not know that you can actually get these. Um, so how do you do that? For some people it's using Google, but for most of us, one of the best ways for us to get reviews is by using LinkedIn recommendations. So I'm going to talk mainly about that, but I'll hit on a couple other ideas too, on how you can get more feedback and reviews. So for LinkedIn, it's super easy to get a review or recommendation in terms of the process of it. And I'm going to give you a couple tips to get more people to actually engage with it. So the first thing is, is on your LinkedIn profile, if you're on LinkedIn and in your profile, you can go up to your options and say to ask for a recommendation. You can pick someone that you're connected to and then ask for a recommendation. What I suggest that you do though is to actually offer to provide that recommendation language for them. Because most of us are really busy and where you're sometimes struggling with like, oh, I don't know what to say or what they want me to say. Make it as easy as possible. So you could offer to say, hey, I would love to have a recommendation from you or testimony about the work we did. You know, if it would be helpful to you, I could draw something up and send it to you and then you can customize that as you see fit. Make it easy. On the other person's end, it's super easy then when they get it to just tweak it a little bit and then put it back through in LinkedIn and then it goes to your profile. Now, if you have to deal with compliance, I know a lot of us do, then you can just submit that through your compliance channel and get it approved before you turn it on on LinkedIn. So you can use hearsay to help expedite that. And then you can put those on your site. In addition, you can also often use those on your website which is a great option. So you could have a page just of testimonials or even better, weave a few testimonials in on your website uh, so that people can get that story directly as they're navigating around your homepage or your team page. They can get a little bit more insights from you. So that's one tip in terms of getting feedback. Another piece might be is putting on your email signature um, a link to be able to request feedback uh, and think about it broadly today. It doesn't have to be a testimonial. Maybe you just want to reach out to somebody to get some feedback on um, how your team's doing. Or if you're thinking about doing a speaking engagement, you know, what do they want to hear about? Uh, or what value have you provided for them in the last quarter? So you can use this in a few different ways on how you can grow and connect with your audience more meaningfully and also spread the word about your business through those testimonials and reviews. Pick one, do it today. We'll be back 